Hello everybody, it's Sean with Ken's Creation, and this is the HTV Rant Auto Heat Press Unboxing. We're going to grab our knife and go ahead and open up uh, the box, and what we find first is the 20 inch by 16 inch Teflon sheet. Some packaging material, we're going to go ahead and remove that, and then I'm going to get the help of Jazzy to pull this out. It's a little heavy, and then we're going to remove some more of that styrofoam packaging. This was packed very well, it looked really good. We're going to go ahead and remove the packaging part of this uh, plastic bag, and once we're done, we'll show you a little more. This is the front control panel, and we'll talk about more of that later. Once you turn on the power, the auto press will automatically lift up. This will allow you to pull out the iron board or the board part that the iron sits on with the pad. Go ahead and push that back in. The dimensions of this machine comes in as a 16 inches wide by 19 inches deep and 11 and a half inches high. It weighs about 37.3 pounds. The pad itself and the iron dimensions are 15 inches by 15 inches. Here is the power button. On top is the temperature button. Right below it is the timer button. And to adjust those, we have the plus and minus button. The next uh, three on the bottom is the mo mode key for different presets, the custom key, and the auto key. And the directions can tell you exactly how those all work. And when the green light R is on, that is your start key. And as you can see, we can change the temperature. We're going to be setting our temperature at 315 degrees. We're going to set our timer for about five seconds, and we'll show you why we're doing that. We've got a uh, polyester t-shirt here that we're going to put some iron-on stuff in. Going to go ahead and set it for five seconds. It's green flashing light. Preheat, preheat for five seconds to get rid of all the moisture and get all the wrinkles out. And just like that, pulls out. We're going to go ahead and pull the bed out and get it all set up. And we're going to take our iron-on material, about four fingers or so from the top there. Once I have that all centered, and good to go. We're going to go ahead and reset that because we need it to be set for about 30 seconds. And we're going to go ahead and slide that in and make sure it's all the way in. There's a little micro switch that needs to be set. And once it's in, it'll go. It might beep at you if it doesn't. Press that green red button. Off we go. And just like that, it is all done. We're going to let that cool for approximately a minute. And once you do that, you can easily pull off the backer sheet. And once we pull that off, Voila, look at that. Perfect. Well, we hope you enjoyed our video. We have more coming. Keep up with us and we'll see you later.